Hello guys, I welcome you to my channel Z Graphics and Multimedia. My name is Rafi Yakub. I'm reaching you live from Lagos State, Nigeria. And in this video, guys, I'm going to teach you the easy way by which you can rename and save your supplier using 1688 Hub. Now, but before we get to the practical study, if you are very new to this channel, please remember to subscribe. And also, if you would like me to procure your link on 1688 Tahoba or Pindodo, Feel free to reach me via the phone number on the screen of this video. Let's also talk more about business if you are interested in using one, any one of my services. And lastly but not the least, if you would like to join my premium class where I coach you step by step on how you too can be an independent self uh, importer, that is an importation you do without using any agent, feel free to reach me via the same phone number on the screen of this video. Let us talk more about premium class only if you have interest, okay? So let's get to the practical started. So like I said earlier, guys, I'm going to teach you guys how to uh, rename and save your supplier on 1688 using 1688 hub. Now, one of the reasons why you need to do this stuff is that it makes it easy for you to identify the supplier and what the supplier is actually selling, okay? These are the most reasons why you do all this stuff. So follow me as I show you step by step on how you can get it done without any stress, okay? So guys, as you can see from the screen here, this is my 1688 app. So I'm going to click on it right away. Then when you open up, the next step you have to take without wasting off your time, click on this place here where you see, click on that. So when you click on that, you have different uh, supplier. I have a lot of supplier here, okay? Now you can decide to name any one of the supplier for easy identification of the supplier. Let's say for instance, I'm interested to rename this particular supplier here. So uh, I'm going to click on the, the supplier link. So when you click on the supplier link, it's going to open up. So you can see this supplier here, what are they into? Let me check. So this supplier here are into selling of, uh, high glasses case. Now, I need to save this particular supplier number with uh, something I can easily remember, okay? So the first next step you have to take is to click on this icon at the top here. Click on that icon. All right, so when you click on the icon, so it's going to uh, brought out the contact detail of the supplier, okay? Now, here, you need to click on here to add the supplier. That's the first thing to do. So I'm going to click on that. Now I have added the supplier. So you can as well go back. Now we have come back to the chat box. So the next step you have to take is to click on here again. So it open up this way, right? So the next thing you have to do is to click on here. This three dot here, click on that. So when you click on that, it's going to pop up this way. So the next thing you have to do is to click on here. Now here, this is where you enter the detail here, this colon here. So I'm going to type in English now. So I will just type I glasses seller. Okay. Seller. All right. So when you are done, then you have to click on here to confirm the change. So I'm going to click on it. Boom. It has been changed. Now, for you to confirm that this is actually work fine, you have to go back to the chat box, continue to go back, and continue to go back. Here we go. This is, this is the supplier now. So this is how you, re, you save and rename your uh, supplier on 1688 hub using, uh, on 1688 using 1688 hub. 
I hope you guys learn one or two things in this video. If you enjoyed this video, guys, give the video a big thumb up. And also, if you would like me to procure your link on 1688, feel free to reach me via the phone number on the screen of this video. And lastly, but not the least, if you would like to join my premium class on importation, you can as well reach me via the phone number on the screen of this video. Let us talk more about importation business if you have interest. Thank you guys for watching this video from the beginning to the end. And I hope to see you guys in my next video. Bye for now.